Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another Fan Feature Friday. Hope you all had a great week. And of course, as always, an even better weekend plan. This week we have Tori from Rio Rancho, New Mexico. That's actually where my aunt and uncle live. And his 2017 TRD Off-Road 4Runner in that beautiful magnetic gray. Love that color. So his Instagram is p4.runner. So if you guys want to follow him, definitely do that. He has a lot of amazing desert shots and stuff being from New Mexico. And he also goes back and forth to uh, Arizona all the time. So that's awesome. And he says he's a longtime follower and fan. So I appreciate it, man, for always commenting. I know you're in the comments and stuff. So I appreciate that, Tori. Some of the mods he's done so far is interior LEDs, aux beam low beams, tactilian flag magnets. He's done the Laminex uh, yellow fog covers. Uh, for his tires, he's put Falcon Wild Peaks AT3s on it. Uh, same stock size, 265, 75, 17s. Raised up the truck a little bit with Dobson's 2.5 suspension. He went with JBA off-road upper control arms. LFD full roof rack. Now this is what it looks like in a full roof rack, guys. Looks freaking amazing. I really wish that the crossbars for that you were able to put onto the full roof rack, but you're not for some reason. Then he has Cali Ray's low profile ditch brackets with aux beam side shot pods. Some future mods to come are sliders. He's undecided on which ones, waiting for the Cali Race review. It should be up next week. Uh, I'm gonna paint them this weekend and everything, and they should be up next week. Uh, skid plates, bumper front and rear, canvas backliner for the dogs, Method 701 wheels with 285s once those 265s wear out. Very smart. Tires are expensive. Why go, man, this dog. Why go right away? Uh, vehicle wrap for paint protection. Undecided if he wants to do a rooftop tent or a ground tent. I think ground tents are cool. It just depends on, you know, nature, especially out in the desert with like Gila monsters and rattlesnakes and stuff. And he's still working on a list for all the extra future mods. So Tori, again, man, thank you so much for sending in your Forerunner. I'm glad I finally uh, am able to see it on Fan Feature Friday. I mean, I see it on Instagram, but I'm glad I get to finally see it on Fan Feature Friday. Guys, thank you for always sending in your vehicles. I really, really enjoy Fan Feature Friday. It's my way to give back to you all. So you guys have a great weekend. Uh, audio stuff will be dropping this weekend. Every video is edited and, uh, and it's ready on YouTube. I just have to make sure all the thumbnails and everything are good for all the videos. It's going to be about 11 videos. So look forward to that. So thank you guys again for stopping in and I will catch you guys in the next Fan Feature Friday. All right, see you later. If you guys want to be featured in Fan Feature Friday, go ahead and shoot me an email at bluetrdjohn at gmail.com. Give me your name, your vehicle. It doesn't have to be a 4Runner. It could be a Tundra, Tacoma, old Celica, Supra. It doesn't matter, just as long as it's a Toyota. And go ahead and give me your location in the United States, or if you guys are out of the United States, let me know what country you guys are watching from. If you guys have a social media, go ahead and put that as well so all of us can start following you. Let us know what modifications you've done to the vehicle and any future modifications that you have to come for your vehicle that you're excited about. So if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead, and I'll see you guys next Friday.